Hey everyone, in today's Photoshop video, I wanna show you one of my favorite things in Photoshop, and that's the ability to outline a picture in Photoshop. And I wanna show you two different outline techniques. One is the simple one, that's a border around your whole picture. So I'm gonna show you that first, but then I'll show you how to outline a subject, like a person, you could outline a person, and that one comes in really handy. I use it for my YouTube thumbnails, for example, all the time. As usual, I have a link to a free trial of Photoshop and my full course on Photoshop in the description below. Let's jump in. Now, I tried this out with a couple of different images and it kind of works the same way and you could change the outline and I'll show you this outside border too. So let's start with that. What if you wanna just create a border around your image, that kind of an outline? Well, let me show you here with a brand new picture. I just downloaded this from pixels.com and I'm just gonna unlock this layer here. And right now, all you have to do to create a border or outline is double click this and this layer style panel comes up. And there's an option here for stroke. So if you click and check this on, you'll get a stroke and you could change the size of the stroke, but you wanna change the position here to the inside. This is gonna make the difference, make sure opacities at a hundred. So let me go ahead and change the color. I'll just do a white. And you could see that is your border or outline around your photo. And you could change the color to whatever you want here. Okay, when you're done, you could always increase the size here as much as you want actually here. And if you wanna do kind of a double border, just press the plus sign on the stroke and create another stroke. So you could do another one and do this one on the center, for example, so you could get this kind of effect, okay? So that's one way, but what about doing an outline around your subject? Let me show you that next. To do that, you have to select your subject first. So with this layer selected, the easiest option is just come up to select and then select your subject from here. And if you're using an older version of Photoshop, you may not have that option, so you have to do the quick selection tool over here instead. Now, all you have to do is press Command or Control J, and basically that just creates another layer with just your subject. So if I turn off the other one, this is what it looks like. And now I could outline this one the same way I showed you in the beginning. Double click and then apply a stroke. So same thing, the stroke option. And I could change the size of the stroke, but you don't want this to be on the inside this time because it's gonna cut into your subject. You want it to be on the outside like that, okay, so there you go. Now you could change the color, so let's say I wanted a, like a bright yellow stroke or something like that, I could go ahead and change it there. You also have an opacity option too if you wanted to play around with that. And this is kinda cool, you could actually do a gradient kind of a border too, or outline, which sometimes comes in handy. I, I like the solid color, what makes the subject pop. Let me press okay, and last thing I like to do when I do this is I take the first layer, I'll double click here, and with the layer style, I like to apply a satin overlay and kind of just lower the opacity to like 30 or something like that to make the subject really, really pop. So I'm not applying this to the subject, but to the background. You can see the before and after here. This is optional, obviously, but I think it's useful. I hope you found this quick video useful. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for easy to follow creative tool videos like Photoshop tutorials, and I'll see you next time.